Well, even better news, we are just days away from the upcoming solar eclipse and the path of totality will pass right near the Bluff City. That's right, and it will just impact your eyes. Our Kevin McNamara is here now to break down uh, its economic impact here at home. Yeah, that's right, Richard Pepper. The path of the totality won't just mean anything other than your eyeballs. It'll mean big business coming here in the Mid-South, particularly Arkansas. The areas where viewers can see the moon totally block the sun will be much wider on Monday than it was in 2017. It's also leading to hotels filling up. Lauren Berry, spokeswoman for Memphis Tourism, says the city's getting prepared for a huge spillover of Eclipse viewers to come into the Bluff City on either side of Monday's event. Arkansas is expected to bring in 1.5 million out-of-state visitors to the state. So this is one of the biggest moments for Arkansas's history, uh, tourism-wise. And so we're preparing just to welcome any visitors that want to come through Memphis on their way to the solar eclipse or after. Um, so we're excited for that. Now you are warned, of course, to wear your glasses if you're going to look at the eclipse and don't pull over on the side of the road. Memphis Tourism says they'll have a full measure of the economic impact here in the Bluff City once it actually takes place. Richard Pepper, back to you. Yeah, I noticed TDOT even has warning signs now on their <laughs> digital readouts. Do not pull over on April 8th. I think that's probably good <laughs> advice. I would that imagine. sounds like it, right. <laughs>